Good morning, boys and girls. How are you doing today? It's so good to see your faces and some people we haven't seen for a little bit, so it is wonderful to see everybody here. Um, I have a little bit of a story that goes with my sermon. So how many of you here like math? Oh, we got two hands, three hands. Yeah, I wasn't one of those. <laughs> well, we had a few people, but I got some simple math here. Okay. What do I have here? What are these? These are books, right? So what if you had, like if you were in first grade or whatever, or second grade, you had an addition. So you have, how many books is this? One? Okay, count. Four. Okay. So we have four books here. So what if we have one book plus one book? What does that equal? Two books, that's easy, right? How about two bucks plus one book? Three. How about two bucks plus two books? Four bucks. Okay, so what if you, with your teacher, um, uh, said one, and she had put on there one book plus one book, and you said it's one book, what would she do? She'd say it's wrong. Right? Because it's like you would say, it's like, that's facts, right? One plus one equals two. How about if uh, you have three books plus one book, and you put the answer is one? It would, your teacher would probably put a big X there, right? That it would be wrong. So, but it's interesting in the Bible, there's some different kind of math that, uh, I'm going to put this aside that is in there. Let's look at Genesis 2, verse 24. Um, sorry, I've got little pieces of paper to help me to turn fast. So it says in Genesis 2, 24, Therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and they shall become one flesh. So we have one man, and one woman, and they're to become one flesh. So they're only, like, in, in God's eyes, one person. So that's a different kind of math, isn't it? Yeah, it's a different kind of math. And then there's uh, also, um, which is going to be our scripture reading, part of our scripture reading. Let's look at John 17, 21. Um, John 17, 21. Oh, look at that. That just worked out perfect. Flipped it right open. That they all may be one, as you... Father are in me, so God the Father is in Jesus, and I in you, that they also may be one in us, that the world may believe that you sent me. So here is another thing. So it's talking about God the Father being in Jesus as being one, and then all of us being with Jesus as being one. That's, that's different math, isn't it? Well, I thought of a little illustration that may help. Oh, it's got a little bit of weight to it here. Okay, I might need some cleanup here. So. Have any idea what's in here? No. Oh. Well, this is kind of math and science put together, okay? So, here. I need this here. So... What do I have here? One snowball. Two snowballs. Three snowballs. Four snowballs. Okay. So, I need my hand for this. What happens when you add one, two, three snowballs together.